progressive web app is very useful feature regarding the front end uh, front end development when we add this feature we basically allow our website to be able to install and remove by the user and uh, your front end will be available offline as well without the internet connection for your user so here we are going to look at a couple of features of uh, progressive web app when we are using the progressive web app um, there are a couple of features which can be used right now we can't use the bluetooth and nfc but uh, if our application is just required a photo or a local notification or accelerometer hardware or, or accelerometer speech recognition then we can definitely use the progressive web app feature of our framework so here we are going to add a progressive web app in the dashboard so let's get started so here this is just an example dashboard which i built for this tutorial and uh, this is the leaflet map which is very famous uh, web map so let's add that feature so here my back end is up and running and my front end is over up and running all we need to do is we just go to the directory where the front end app is located here now all we need to do is if you haven't installed ng in the global like i have done all you need to do is npm run ng and then add at the red angular and uh, uh, slash pwa right for a progressive web app definitely and then just uh, hit enter and all it will do is just uh, add a couple of uh, extension for uh, our web app to enable the progressive web app so all you need to do is restart the your application after adding uh, pwa feature in your angular application So you might be thinking that there should be an install button over here so to enable that kind of thing all you need to do is build this uh, application for production for that we are going to use this npm run build command but for uh, for this purpose all we need to do is npm run ng build the de the production version of this uh, build is essential then and then the service worker will be enabled right so then we are going to enable this command now all we need to do is install a couple of more modules to just enable the server so we are going to install the http server for just uh, testing purpose for develop for production you can also use the firebase also it will work fine in the firebase also if you want to see how we can deploy our application to firebase just comment down it below or you can find more resources on, over youtube now all we need to do is npm run sorry npx okay then just hit enter and our application is enabled all we need to do is just go to the application again right it is enabled now as you can see over here there is an install button all you need to do is, is just install right so our app is now web app I mean so app is our app is now progressive web app all we need to do is just turn off the Wi-Fi and close this application and all we can do is go to here and so for uh, so right now it is uh, offline so I won't be able to log in but as I turn on the Wi-Fi so as you can see over here it is just an application like any other application all we need to do is 
log into this application right I am logged in and as I can see I will get my data I also my user profile over here and yeah so thank you guys for watching and uh, see you in the next one